Well, you know what? I, I love riding at Del Mar. Uh, of course, Bing Crosby owned it at one time. Every time you come on the racetrack, uh, he, he sings a song for the first race where the surf meets the turf down at old Del Mar. Um, I, I loved it there. I loved it there. You know, you could actually, if you're sitting in the grandstand, you can see the ocean from the grandstand. It's just a beautiful setting. Uh, the surface to ride over, it was an excellent surface to ride over. The, the dirt track was always in tremendous shape. Uh, the only thing I could say for the Europeans is maybe that short stretch down the, down the stretch uh, on the turf. Uh, the turf is a little bit shorter stretch. A lot of times you have to make your move on the turn, and you'll see them bunching up at the head of the stretch a little bit, Joe. That could be a factor for those Europeans who aren't used to that, uh, tight, those tight, that tight funnel turn on the yep. turf. Well, it definitely could, and, and like I say, sometimes – you make your move down the backstretch coming into the final turn. And <laughs> I remember so many times, so many times getting in trouble on that turn, trying to make my move, trying to find a spot to go. And most of the time you had to wheel out to the outside. So it's going to be interesting because I, I know a lot of the European riders, they don't like to lose very much ground. So they try and stay down on the inside. So it's going to be pretty interesting. That's for sure. I've got it. I'm starting to think that maybe, you know, because of those tight turns, when you're looking at those turf races, I, maybe you're right. going to give the uh, North American horses a little more respect than you normally would in, the, in, in these in these trip races. Yeah, I will all defer to Sandy in terms of a trip, but I mean, Sandy, if it's a, a quirky turf course, I mean, this one's not too bad just because it's just a flat mile. So it's, uh, you know, just the regular go around. But if it's kind of a quirky turf course, would you rather draw inside or outside? Uh Probably somewhere in the middle, Jason, <laughs> would, would be better. Okay. <laughs> but uh, right. the outside, yeah, you're, you're going to kind of get uh, hung out a little bit going into that first turn. Inside, you could get squeezed. So I used to love exactly. the fly post. That was like my favorite post. But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm sure the European riders as well will be out there walking the turf course. So they're, they're going to know how, yeah. much, how much distance they have left once they get to the turn. And a lot of times, uh, like if you're just off the pace, you don't have to make your, your move to the head of the stretch, and then you're free and clear. But uh, I'll tell you what, if, if Frank Yatori's on a horse, uh, I don't think I'd leave him out of my exactors. He is the man when it comes to turf racing. Look at this. I'm enjoying my morning coffee in my brand new Joe Tilly's Great Canadian Sports Show coffee mug. Now, if you like the show, and you want a support program, you can get one of these too, or some other merchandise. Just click on the link below and enjoy your morning coffee.